The day is August 11th. I had some sprouts from the pear trees. So I'll be putting them in the ground. Okay, if you go back in the videos when I first did this, you'll see, um, check, get the dates and everything. But if you see where I put it in the uh, fridge, you see that root coming out the bottom right there. And you see too where the plant I, where it already started to you see where the plant's starting to come out. So what I'll be doing now, I'll just be placing them in some dirt. But let me take its course like I did with the apple seeds. Did the same process, same everything. And I'll just be placing the um plant from the bottom to see where it already started to open. Okay, now that everything is complete, it's just a waiting game. We'll see. Alright, start the video up with the transplants. Well, I kept this one in there. I just pruned these two. And I have a transplant. Transplant was complete. By the way, today is August. Wednesday, August 14th. Here go the other sprouts. Finally got around to separate and everything. This is another plant that was made. I believe this is an eggplant. If you um go back in my videos, you'll know what I'm talking about. These sprouts. Can't really remember what this is, but I had my thoughts. I'm not sure. Um, this may be the lemon tree, I'm not sure, but I don't know when it grows more. You see, I have two other sprout and another sprout working on. Another sprout coming. Alright, more than sure, this is watermelon. I believe this is fruiting right here. I'm not really sure. Hope it's not just a bud, but I'm more than sure that's a fruit starting to fall. But if you've been keeping up, the same like ever since that rain hit this plant has been growing at a very rapid rate. Me do melon also coming along very nice, very, very nice. And the kind of look. Very good. Still waiting for us to get a little bit more yellow before I harvest it. But as we see, it's coming along very well. <laughs> Peppermint looking very good, starting to flower. So I might just collect some more seeds for them. And the spring onions. I finally got around to doing putting some stuff in the ground. It goes on to the other peppers and the other pepper. Finally put them in the ground. So we're gonna watch some of the grass. Even down to my extra melons. I'll put them in the ground. Some took the transplant very well. Some it looks like they may be in a little shot. So only time will tell.